Hi everyone. I hope you are good and enjoying your life. So welcome again to Inspiration Academy. Many people have came to me and told me that could you please share some interview questions related to web application firewall model for F5 because they have been asking in interviews except LTM they ask about questions from global traffic managers and web application firewall which is the leading product for F5 it can do many things which firewalls cannot do so we'll discuss some questions and answers and after that we will do some practicals for web application firewall so that our students can get more benefit out of it so most important question which is asked in interview is what is difference between a layer 7 firewall which is called as next generation firewall and web application firewall in f5 what can f5 asm can do which Palo Alto firewall cannot do so customer come to you and you have gone to the call with them and you need to give them demonstration you need to tell them why they require f5 web application firewall so can it be due to the extra layer of security can it protect some attacks which Palo Alto or checkpoint firewall cannot detect so you need to ready with the data sheet and advantages to gain customer confidence question number two why should i use f5 web application firewall which i have discussed previously in question number one they both are interrelated when i have another layers and firewall in market who can protect me from web application attacks why exactly i need f5 web application firewall basically now they have introduced as advanced web so another question which comes in mind is what is the difference between f5 web and advanced web question number third would be can f5 protect from OWASP top 10 what is OWASP top 10 and how asm protected so you need to go through OWASP top 10 and you need to see how f5 web can protect it can Palo Alto firewall can protect from a vast top 10 you need to test it and come back in any doubts you can comment another question which is generally asked in interview is is web a positive security model or negative security model i heard these terms in 101 exam most of the people who have attended this certification must know about this term what is positive security model and what is negative security model because most of the questions have been come in exam 101 related to it question number five does f5 web allows all traffic by default or it is it like a firewall which deny all traffic by default so you need to know how does it function what is the design and architectural form how you create a policy does it create a policy which will allow all traffic or which will deny all traffic by default so you need to know the policy structure how it builds what parameters it can protect another question is what is the difference between deployment mode which can be used in f5 web so there are four types of deployment mode and what is the difference between them and suppose i have to implement i have to provision the asm in my company for the customer which method i should use which deployment mode i should use you need to know and difference between them another most common question which they ask is difference between transparent and blocking mode in f5 web application firewall so they they will ask you if i put my asm policy in transparent mode what will happen if i put my policy in blocking mode will it block traffic will it cause any issues how you will proceed 
so this were the some basic questions we will discuss answers tomorrow i would request everyone to go through these questions and try to answer if in any doubt they can always comment our team continuously monitoring our youtube channel which is inspiration academy and our trainers try to give answer as soon as possible so all the best i hope this will benefit you all thank you